Hi everyone and welcome to a new training vlog. On the beginning of the training, as always, I started by trying out different techniques to see which trick I was the most comfortable with. Normally, I do each trick separately, but to challenge myself a little bit and to show more interesting combos, I decided to combo each trick. To make the combo strong but not last too long, I decided to start with two tricks alto revs or two revs and not exceeding the combo's length over 15 seconds. A lot of freestylers like Erland use this method to keep a better shape for more difficult tricks on the long run. And I had a rare but great feeling because the ball was popping off perfectly, my legs were light and my style was satisfying so I kept training combos for like 15 minutes. I was pretty satisfied with this combo because the first two tricks were performed on the weak side and the ball wasn't moving too much from the center which was a key point for me and when it comes to style I always try to keep the ball on the same height as well as not moving too much from the point where I started my combo but what's very difficult is not to turn around especially when you do ATVs in a row so I have to fix that for future combos. On this combination I wanted to finish strong with a crossover to an alt homie to Zani no touch but this trick is difficult to set up for me so I decided to move on to an alt homie to Zani which is much easier and it saved the combo. At this point of the session I felt warm and I wanted to do more difficult combinations so I tried out some no touch variations to 2 rev no touch and to Zani to alt homie to Zani no touch worked very good for me so I decided to go for it. I did it three times and I decided to move to a combo I'm trying for almost two years which is back around the world to alternative homie to Zani no touch. So here the best tries of the combo which I tried for 45 minutes and maybe it was a mistake to train it that long because I was more comfortable on other tricks and maybe if I would have trained those my session would have been more productive. But it's very important to keep positive after each session so I told myself that I will work more on my back around the world which is a weakness for me and I think I will unlock this combo very soon. You will definitely see it and um, thanks for watching, stay tuned and see you in the next vlog.